Flick over the top by Burns, picked up by Jonathan Joseph and chipped off to Delon Armitage. Armitage rides two tackles, still manages to get it out wide to touch his carb out. He straightens and cuts back inside the big summer and winger up to halfway. Support from Casey, offload untidy. And it spills over. So Pearson had already given the penalty here to Gloucester. What's his decision to be? Casey trying to calm it down with Strokosh and the referee finally gets control of the situation once again. Well, Jim Hamilton still having afters and it spills over again with Hamilton having gone off and the fists fly and it all spills over again and now both sets of teams, all players involved. And the referee is going to have to sort this out very quickly indeed. Totally unnecessary unpleasantness. It was all set off as Jim Hamilton had just been yellow carded by Dave Pearson and still hasn't been separated. Van Raffenbach pulling back there on David Pace who also has been yellow carded. Will Dave Pearson change that yellow to a red? Well, a massive blow from Jim Hamilton. I think this is going to be a red card for Jim Hamilton and also for David Pace. Van Rathenbach. Casey as well and Jim Hamilton. Two red cards. Both have just been yellow carded. Oh, what an unfortunate way to end the season there. Poor David Pace. And he also came off very much second best in the fight against Jim Hamilton. Further words being had here now. In fact, all spilled over. So there might be a few further cards to be brandished. Mike Tindall looks on. That was the moment where Jim Hamilton landed a vicious blow and it all spilt over very quickly indeed. Trevianus getting in. Dave Lewis being knocked down. And the, the red cards confirmed for both Jim Hamilton and David Pace. Scott Lawson having further words here. And the skipper Bob Casey just having some confirmation there and all of it will return now for a penalty to Gloucester which Freddie Burns will take after that series of altercations that's used up about five minutes of time.